Hi guys, Kim Crosser, Crosstown Realtor with EXP Realty. Welcome to World Cup Wednesday. Hey, um, I know you've probably been following along and you've seen my countdown, but in case you missed a day, I thought I would give you a quick recap. So here are 28 See Me Fun Facts, and they're kind of um, related to the countdown days to the World Cup. Anyway, but they are See Me Fun Facts, not so much soccer facts. All right, here we go. Cup. Hey, did you know that on the 28th of September in 2005 that Simi had one of the largest fires in our city's history? Cup. I know it's not Hey, a did fun you know that Jared Weaver was number 27 when he played for the Padres? And for those of you that don't know who Jared Weaver is, he played high school baseball here in Simi and then began his professional career when he was drafted 12th in the first round of the 2004 draft by the Angels. Till the World so, Cup. Fun. Hey, did you know that Simi is only 26 miles from the Burbank Airport? How great is that, that we are so close to a non-busy, kind of major airport? World Cup. Hey, did you know that on average, Simi only has 25 days with measurable precipitation? Now, I realize that this average will probably be a lot higher after this year's rain, but currently only 25 days with measurable precipitation. World Cup. Okay. Hey, did you know that Simi Valley's Park and Recreation offers 24 sports fields? So city baseball fields, softball fields, soccer fields, baseball fields that can be used for softball or soccer. World Cup. So there you go. As you probably know, Simi's bordered by State Route 23, affectionately referred to as the 23. Did you know that the 23 runs from Malibu to Fillmore? And a good portion of that is through Canyon. World Cup. Those of you hey, that did you know that we have 22 tennis courts available to the public here in Simi Valley? Some of those also have nets available so they can be converted to pickleball courts, which is, it's fun to have that option. And I'll be mentioning pickleball courts specifically in a future countdown Cup. number. Any hey, did you know that the 21st of December is historically the coldest day of the year in Simi Valley, with temperatures ranging from 46 to 63 degrees Fahrenheit? World Cup. Hey, did you know that 20% of the working population in Simi works in Simi? So, yep, most commute, but uh, most people that do commute don't commute more than probably 20 miles. World Cup. Okay. Hey, did you know that Don McLean was the 19th pick in the first round of the 1992 NBA draft? Don't know who Don McLean is? He played high school basketball here in Simi Valley and then went on to play for UCLA. And while he was there, he became the all-time scoring leader of both the school and the Pac-12. Okay. Hey, did you know that Simi's average annual precipitation is 18.39 inches i think it's a pretty safe bet to say that we'll be above average this year yeah. so um, hey, did you know that mickey jones played on 17 gold records if you've been here for a while you knew him as the biggest star to come out of simi valley and he was so great as to also be in commercials for local businesses Cup. Yep. okay this might be a bit repetitive for those of you that watch my content but i did want to remind you that if you're looking for a fun place to watch the world cup games check out the 16 videos I did during March Madness Sweet 16, where I highlighted 16 fun places to watch your favorite sporting event in Simi Valley or Moore Cup. Park. Hey, did you know that Shailene Woodley's birthday is on the 15th of November? For those of you that don't know, Shailene Woodley was raised in Simi Valley. The World Cup. In fact, hey, did you know that Jeff Weaver made his Major League Baseball debut on the 14th of April in 1999 and he was also drafted 14th in the first round of the 1998 draft so 14 seems to be a pretty good number for him and yes that's Jeff Weaver not to be confused with Jared Weaver who, who hey who did I you know that on the 13th of January in 1770 the first Europeans traversed the Valley of Simi 1770 is that crazy so just a Two short centuries later, we officially became incorporated as Simi Valley. For the World Cup. Okay, hey, did you know that the cross at the top of Mount McCoy is 12 feet tall? If you've never seen it, there's a lovely hike you can do that will take you to the top of the hill to see this beautiful cross. World Cup. Hey, did you know that Simi Valley has 11 picnic pavilions? Have you ever had a party in one of Simi's pavilions? World Cup. We okay, so when I was doing my research, I found that Simi has 10 pickleball courts, but I have to admit that info might be a bit outdated because I've seen pickleball courts popping up all over town. Yeah, for you. Personally, did you know that on the 9th of April, 1990, Scott Radinsky made his major league debut for the White Sox? Days. Yep, Scott. Hey, did you know that Simi is part of Ventura County Waterworks 8th District? Well, the World Cup. Well, you're in charge hey, did you know that we have seven gazebos in our public parks? How great is that? I mean, who doesn't love a charming gazebo? The World Cup. Okay. Hey, did you know that Motel 6 was the first chain hotel or motel in Simi Valley that's actually still standing? More importantly, do you know how Motel 6 Hey, did you know that Simi Valley has five high schools? Five high schools. 
that lends itself to some pretty good crosstown rivalries. World Cup. Luckily. Hey, did you know that before Simi was incorporated, our city was actually split into four separate communities, originally called yeah. Simi. Hey, did you know that Simi Valley has three golf courses? That number's fluctuated a bit over the Cup. years. And hey, did you know that Simi Valley is the second largest city, population-wise, in the county of Ventura? Oh. Behind Any guesses what I have as number one for Simi Valley? I couldn't really find data to confirm nor deny this, so I'll admit it's a bit subjective, but I would say that Simi Valley is the number one place to live in Southern California, if not the entire U.S. If you don't agree, let's get coffee. I'll at least have you convinced it's top 10 by the time we're done. So there you go, my World Cup countdown filled with Simi fun facts. Thanks so much for following along as we waited together for the World Cup to start. All right, go Simi. Go U.S. Go soccer girls. Woohoo!